This is Communion Sunday. The children stay in here. Hallelujah. The children will stay with us this morning. We're going to have the Lord's Supper shortly. I'm going to minister on something that some of you are going to shout with me and say, Hallelujah, yes. Some of you are going to say, Oh, me. Some of you say, What does that have to do with communion this morning? I might say nothing. Is anybody with me? But I've got a subject I feel like God has spoken to my heart about that is vitally important today to the body of Christ. And that's understanding the shackles and the strongholds and the chains of debt. Thank you for those three amens. You see, the world's indebted. The world's in deep debtedness. Not only our government, but many people that's involved. And the world says it's okay. It really doesn't matter. In fact, there's a lot of churches that go in great big indebtedness and feel like they're waiting for the rapture to take place. That the Lord will catch us away and leave all indebtedness to the rest of the world is left. Is anybody with me? But that's not a godly thing. That's not a, that's that's not what the word says. And I'm going to share a few things about understanding the stronghold of indebtedness. I believe God I'm not necessarily qualified to speak on this subject. My wife Mickey is more the expert in finances. But I am qualified because personally I'm out of debt. Not only am I out of debt, but this church is out of debt. <laughs> 